One man the focus of attention. Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Van der Bayou here on EA TV. Hello from one of the great venues in world football, the Estadio Santiago Bernabeu in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And we're focusing on, technically speaking, one of the best leagues in the world. I'm talking, of course, about La Liga. It's Real Madrid up against Real Betis. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the... And up for grabs off the keeper. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Carvajal starts with Ferlon Mendy in the fullback positions. Vinicius Jr. starts with Rodrigo out wide. And lining up through the middle in attack today is Kylian Mbappe. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And here's the starting 11 for Real Betis. Rui da Silva begins between the posts. Pablo Fornals plays with Ayose Perez out wide. And leading the line today is William. And space available inside. Mark Roca. Now with Perez. Making progress. Perez. Great defending here. Was always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Vinicius Junior. An effective challenge. Attacking possibilities for Real. And he might be through here. And a goal! 1-0. And what a fast start they've made to this game. Well, just look at this again. It's so hard to knock off the ball once he gets going. Of course the defending could be better, but that's a great individual goal. The match has restarted, 1-0 here. Mark Roca. Carman Petzela. Rodriguez. Well, they have the ball once more. From long range. And narrowly off target here. Well, it's still all to play for, but that was a good effort, wasn't it? Of intervention there. Socrates. On the ball, Mark Rocca. Going well. Crossing opportunity. Space for Real out wide. Mbappe. Well, he so badly wanted to net another one, but the keeper playing his part. Well, maybe that should have been his second, but you can see another one coming. He's playing so well here. And well off target in the end. Good pressure from the defender to put him off.
Real find themselves in a position of menace. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Socrates. Opportunity here, and the goal it is for Real Madrid. They are on a victory course. Well, here it is again, and the keeper's lost his concentration here. He's totally in the wrong position. He'll be disappointed with that. Well, that's just what Ancelotti wanted. He has to be happy with this performance from his team. So, underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. It is a decent-looking attack here. Mendy. Mendy has it. Nicely cut out. What can Real do from this position? Well, I bet he's a bit sloppy in possession. Eder Militao. And Valverde. He'll have a go here. Well, I'll tell you what, surprising everyone by taking on the shot from that range. Yeah, that was certainly a good effort from that sort of distance. Really struck it cleanly. Jose Perez and the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them committed challenge well good run and good ball control could cross it in here Decided to take on the shot from a difficult angle. Not a memorable effort, though. Well, you have to question the decision-making there. Could he have cut it back? The angle was always against him. Eder Militao. Rudiger. Here's Carvajal. Now Eder Militao. Mendy. Almost weighing up the opposition with a string of neat passes. Brahim. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. Well, he fancied his chances, but shame about the finish ultimately. Rodrigo and played in under pressure he'll be breathing a sigh of relief ball one Real Madrid doing well to regain possession here well cleared away Well, the half-time interval fast approaching, and it's so far so good for Real Madrid, certainly. Stuart, your assessment. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. He's driven in the corner. Well, not cleared away completely. 
Diaz. Eder Militao. Brahim. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Mark Roca. William. Perez. And that'll be offside. Mbappe. Good tackle. Mark Roca. Herman Petzela. On the ball, Mark Roca. Pablo Fornals with it. Getting in there to intercept. Mbappe. Just look at this again. He moves the ball quickly, he gets beyond his marker and he keeps his composure. It's an excellent finish. Well, no wonder Ancelotti's delighted. They're bossing the game now. Well, on they go again. And Real very much in control. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. Vinicius Junior. And that is that half time here in the Spanish capital. And on the evidence of what we're seeing in this match, Kylian Mbappe is a striker at the peak of his powers, you've got to say, Stuart. Roll the key. And the ball rolling again after what was a dazzling first 45 from Real. Can they repeat that in the second half? This attack looks highly promising. Really good challenge. Vinicius Junior. Mendy. Eder Militao. Mendy. A super tackle and they've won possession. Hector Bellerin. Carman Petzela. Now Bellerin. A Jose Perez. Well read to win possession back. And that'll be a Betis throw-in. Hector Bellerin. Well, he keeps going. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. Carvajal. Vinicius Junior. Well, he did his best to place that one, but a disappointing end result. Racing past his man. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. He's 
got to have a go here. And the free kick caught cleanly by the keeper. William. It's with Socrates. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Real did well to regain control of the ball. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Mendy. Chouameni. Excellent passing. Rodrigo. And quick thinking defensively. We have 30 minutes to go. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle. And the referee has got to book him, I think. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Vinicius Junior. Shaping to shoot. No way through. Makes his way in field. And the keeper diving to thwart him. Well, a corner right on the back of the last one. Favouring the short one. Well, space if he goes inside. Magnificent defending. Well, another corner kick conceded. Let's see what they do this time. Lex to go short. And veering in. Socrates doing the thwarting. A Jose Perez. Pedzela. On to Perez. Perez. Happy to take on the shot. Oh, a smart stop. <laughs> Playing it in. On the corner. Too close to the goalkeeper that time. Pressure applied. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. William. And now Rodrigo. A struggle for Real Madrid to hang on to the ball. William! Keeper getting the touch. And eventually, goalkeeper's ball. Well, you can sense the relief amongst his teammates, but what a first save that was. Carvajal. Rodrigo. Betis with the ball again. Working really well as a team to regain possession. Vinicius Jr. It's a fierce effort. Well, just narrowly over the crossbar. Good hit, though.
Well, Real Madrid are looking really good today. Just look how many chances they've created. And I sense there's still more to come here. A Jose Perez. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. Real Madrid regaining possession. Just 15 minutes remaining. Can he make it count? Tremendous defending to stonewall him. Oh, it was a terrible looking challenge and a big decision for the official here. Well, a tale of utter frustration. Straight red card. And now they're going to have to do this the difficult way. Well, no coming back now. That's unforgivable. It's a poor tackle. It really is. And showing fine vision. Out of play and a Betis throw in forthcoming. Rewarded for that brilliant high press. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. Rodriguez. The timing was perfect. Ball one. He's in here. Is it going to be? And a goal! He's put it away. A celebratory moment. Well, as you can see, this is absolutely brilliant. He's such a good runner with the ball, and it's a great individual goal. Brilliant from him. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. William Perez Real Madrid coming away with it great effort to keep that one in play Aurelien Chouameni. This attack looks highly promising. Well, he did his best to place that one, but a disappointing end result. Brahim. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Well, Real Madrid fans have enjoyed this. A dominant performance, you've got to say, Stuart. Well, what can you say about this performance? They've been absolutely brilliant. They've played with such guile and creativity, and their passing has been so expansive. Not many teams would have stopped them today. Prevented the damage. Over it comes. Clearance left a bit to be desired. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Miranda. Well, lovely work to get past his man. Bayerine. 
stopped a sure fire goal. Well, no point in stopping play. Advantage with them. And it might be. And keeping it out. Aurelia Chouameni. And that is that. The end of the game. It goes into the books as a win for Real Madrid. What did you think of their overall performance? Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. Well, choose your descriptive word where Kylian Mbappe is concerned. Explosive is one adjective you could use, Stuart. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.